No, their theater still shows the classics. I'm not looking for you to work at another theater. I'm looking for you to take into account your four-year, $200,000 liberal arts degree. Okay, why don't you just sell the frame because it's worth more than the diploma? I don't think you've ever taken your future into consideration. Look at your cousin Sylvia. She's been promoted to manager at her accounting firm. She's only been there three years. Okay, mother. Okay. I'm going to be up in my room, and then you can come tell me when Sylvia gets promoted to VP. Dear Miss Ryan Fremont, I regret to inform you... At least they know I'm a girl this time. If you don't mind, you fill in the names. That'll make it even more official. You think of everything, don't you? And the names are Mr. and Mrs. Victor Laszlo. But why my name, Richard? Because you're getting on that plane. You don't mean that? You're just saying that's why I don't come with you. I've got a job to do, too, and where I'm going, you can't follow. But I've got to do, you can't be in the party. Ryan, I'm no good at being noble, but it doesn't take much to see that the problems of three little movie ushers don't amount to a hill of beans in this crazy world. Someday you'll understand that. Here's looking at you, kid. No, no. Here's looking at you, kid. Honestly, my mom seemed excited I was leaving. I probably should have taken that person. Okay, the line is, I don't know anything about it. Bobby never told me a thing. Thank you. Yeah. Quiet on set, action.